for tomorrow's demo, what we are going to showcase is a set one mode sending post requests to UbiDots. UbiDots is an online IoT cloud platform that allows you to visualize and manage your data easily. We are using the set one mode pair with the Raspberry Pi as a border router to translate and to send traffic from 15.46 low bank wireless networks to the internet. Our setup is quite easy. We have a set one mode uh, sending data to UV dots using regular batteries. Uh, this has a low power consumption, a low power footprint, over 300 times less than Wi Fi, and you can have several devices creating a mesh network amongst them, sending data to the border router, and then to internet. What we are doing now is sending temperature values from the built-in sensor, the set one mode features, and a sequence number that indicates uh, how long the set one mode has been active, allowing us to detect if there is a reset or a power loss. What we are doing is using Contiki to program the devices using the UB dots library. In here what we are doing is basically each 15 seconds sending a post request to UV dots and then visualizing them. Visually, and then at the border router is being that work to the internet. This is an example of the output of the set one mode sending post requests. We are seeing here the 200 code indicating the post was successful. At the Raspberry Pi we have these following interfaces. We are using a tunnel created by Gogo6, having a bridge connection to in my Ethernet interface, and then creating a virtual tunnel for the border router which is accessible over the, the internet from anywhere. So this is the web service my border router has. And you can see that my UbiDots device is being routed. And I can access my device from anywhere in the world. What I'm going to do now is make a ping request from an outside network. Uh, what I see here is the response. Basically, only 70, uh, 77 milliseconds of reply from an online server across the across the world to Barcelona. And here, I am receiving the data at EV dots using the dashboards. So, I will restart the the device. Now it should begin to connect to the border router, I create a mesh networking and then it's ready to post and send data. If I refresh the screen, I will shortly see how the sequence, num sequence number has been restarted. Proving that the device has been restarted, has been rebooted and now it's sending data again. So it's back online and it's back again sending posts to UbiDots.